What's up? Guys, welcome back to the Redneck TV channel. And today, we're gonna be catching giant fish with a bow and arrow. I'll show you all my bow and everything when I get down there. Got the light on charge in the truck right now. Bow fishing. Not a lot of people know about bow fishing. I didn't until like two, three years ago. Sorry about the wind. It's loud. Try to turn y'all this way. Yeah, ever since I started bow fishing, that's all I want to do. I like it way more than regular fishing. Even though most of it is just nasty ass fish, there's still some big ass fish and they put up a fight. They're fun to reel in. But yeah, I got the little GoPro, got some batteries charged up, and I'm going to take y'all with me tonight on the head mount. Figure we go ahead and get out there during the day, and then once it starts getting darker, we'll put the boat in. Without further ado, go ahead and get down there. All right, y'all. Finally down here. This is my bow. Got an Oneida, black with fish skulls on it. Reel is a Mega Mouth 2.0. Basically, you know, arrow, string attached to it. And after you shoot it, the line's connected to the arrow. Then you pull this little lever back and reel her in. Pretty cool. I used to not use this little safety slide deal here. I used to just tie it through the hole of the arrow. But I guess with this new reel, the line that came with it is a lot thinner. And I guess the hole in there, the fibers in there were too sharp, kept cutting my line. I think the arrow flies a lot better in the water when you tie it to the hole. I'd rather have an arrow go down there. Well, damn. My shit wasn't even recording the entire time I was down there. I've shot five silver. Knock broke. I had to get another arrow. All right, let's go down here and shoot a few more. Going. Going. How are you doing? Shooting anything good? I uh, just nasty ass silver. Bemo Jr. Let me tie your hook on for you, son. <laughs> All right, y'all, we're about to put the boat in. My buddy Jasper with me. Out there shoot a few big heads it's anything like it was last time It'd be everywhere but it didn't seem like it from the bank there's a, they're everywhere see them just silvers so there's a bunch right here <laughs> see them along the wall you can see them with the lights off better and the lights on hope my video can see this this is insane you just take a random shot you're hitting it May as well double up. This motherfucker's violent. Someone please direct me to the nearest bill. Spoon? He's a honker. I got that on camera. That was crazy. He jumped like six feet out of the water. <laughs> Getting the fuck out of here. Hell, it used to. It just used to be worm, and it would fucking start before the siren. I was back there. It turned on before the siren even went. About fucking died. About got stuck back there in that floodgate. I think that was just a small spoonbill. That's a big head. That's a fucking big head, boy. Yes, sir. She ain't too big, but she's fat. I had to have stuck that motherfucker right on top of the water. A little baby. There we go. What the hell? Do you, you see that? Yeah. Bro, that was a spoonbill with its head eaten off and it was still swimming. I've never seen that before. Silver. Ooh, he's a little fucked, didn't he? Uh, hello? Oh my god, did I stick it? Holy shit. There's a big boy right here, dude. If I hit the right one. You don't feel that heavy. Never mind. <laughs> Yeah. 
That's the wrong fucking dog I'm at right there, boy. Oh, yeah, that's a bitch. Yeah, no, 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 I think so, yeah. I thought he was like 100 pounds. Where's the heads? Sheesh. Ah, I missed him. I think I missed him. Damn it. Fucking head on him. 10 foot wide. Whoa. This is fucking crazy. Like, if we were shooting for silvers, we'd have had 100 of them by now. Damn. Shootout. Oh, I didn't do it in time. All right, y'all. Got a little over 10 fish in the boat. I just feel like these honkers are just weighing the front of the boat down. So I'm gonna go ahead and take them out. Give y'all a better look on these big ones. Screen went over. Decent one right there. I think that's the biggest one. I think this one's pregnant because it's super heavy. Bad. Got like 10 of these just plain silvers. Dump all these fish out. Get some more. We got to get a giant big head tonight, folks. I'm talking scary big. Way bigger than the two that we've shot so far. Out here alone at Barkley. My buddy went home. He's got work tomorrow. I got to stay out here and put work in on these fish for y'all. Is that blood or water? Oh, sure hope that ain't water in the boat. Probably just water that got in the boat from the fish flapping. Fucking everywhere. Nothing I'm interested in though. If I see a big silver, I'll shoot it. This moon is just so bright. If you just look down the line of it, you can just see fish everywhere. Like all those bubbles up there, they're fish. Right here. Hey, they're just everywhere tonight, man. Well, we're looking for different species under than silvers. Because silvers are the most populated. Oh, there's a big hit. Got him. Yeah, like I was saying, silvers are the most populated. And this is what I'm going for, what I'm about to pull up right now. These are big heads. And uh, yeah, their heads are just bigger. They got spots on them, look a little different. They get a lot bigger than silvers do, and they're just more rare, so. And he's decent. It's about to pull out. Damn, he's a fighter. Uh, that's a honker. It's a pretty good size. Come on now, come on, come on. Quit. Spoonbill. I missed him. Did you see that? Weird that spoonbill looked. It had a huge head on it, but a tiny, tiny body. Spoonbill swimming with silver. That's weird. He was swimming weird. Kind of thought he was a spoonbill. Sometimes really skinny silvers look like spoonbill. Damn. It's a big ass pack of coyotes in the woods. I don't know if y'all can hear them. What the hell is that? That thing was huge. I don't know why that thing looks so fat. I don't know if this is a silver or what. Big old boy. Yeah, it's a fat silver. For some reason its belly's huge. What the hell? Must be pregnant. Fuck him. Caught him slipping. That's a big head. Mm. Little spoonbill. That's another spoonbill. Why is there so many spoonbill? <laughs> yeah. That's a little baby. I shouldn't even have shot that spoonbill. Kind of small. Your limit is only two a day. It's another spoonbill. I missed it, didn't I? Damn it, man. Dude, I just suck tonight, man. <gasps> please, please. This is the biggest spoonbill I've ever got in my life. I think. Yeah. For sure. <sighs> Woo! Fuck yeah. Oh, yes. That's a fucking spoonbill right there, buddy. Yes, sir. Oh, yes. Oh, he scared the fuck out of me. Oh, I 
did not expect to see a spoon bill. Stoned him too, right through the fucking brain. I'm shaking still, man. He just, he looked giant in the water. He's a pretty big one, but I thought he was way bigger. It's the first time I've ever shot a decent spoon out of a boat. Hell yeah, man. That makes my whole night right there. I see another big ass spoon. I'm just gonna throw that little one back, act like I never shot it. Or I'll just say I shot it before midnight. <laughs> Look at that gar. Did I actually hit that? No way. Oh, I hit it, but I didn't stick it. Fucker is as skinny as my arrow. He's a pretty big one. Fuck him though. Where the, where the, where the bill's at, huh? Yeah, where the bill's at. Where, 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 where the bill's at. There's another spoon bill. Little fucker though. Damn it, I missed him, man. All I need is one more bill. That was a spoon. Oh, I got him. Oh, no, I pulled out. Oh, no, I didn't. He's pulling me everywhere, man. Like, it's insane. I don't think he's that big. He's just fighting hard, hard. Oh, a lot bigger than I thought. Please don't fall off. Oh, yeah. Oh, my gosh. Wow. Oh, yeah. Beautiful. He did not really look that big. I thought he was a lot smaller. He's pulling me into the turbines at first. It was a little scary. All right. Well, my battery died while I was out there fishing. I only shined for a few more minutes and I left. But when I left, it was insane, man. When I was leaving, there were so many fish in front of me that I literally had to pull the trawler up because the propeller was just going. <laughs> it sounded just like I was just smacking into a bunch of rocks. It was terrible. Never in my life have I seen the silvers running like that. Well, yeah, there's the fish right there, y'all. Two big ass spoonbills, four big heads. And then one fat honking ass silver. I've never seen one that fat before. Yo, fat ass. Now, I need to go get something to freaking eat, man. I literally have not eaten a single thing today. It's over 24 hours without a single calorie. So because of that, I'm going to Waffle House right now. And I'm going to eat approximately two days worth of food. I'm skin them spoon bill when I get home. All right, y'all. I'm going to skin these boys up. Kidding me wants to do this, so just bear with me. Oh, do you see that? It's all inside its spinal cord. That's, a, that's some spoonbill meat right there. You just cut it into steaks, cut the center out, all the little red strips of meat on the edges. Literally full of shit. What if he was constipated? Got two hunks of spoonbill meat. This one's got a lot more meat to it. A lot heavier. Gonna give the guts to old Bobby Q. Let him slop them up. Got all the spoonbill cut into little steaks like this. Now all this red meat you see on the edges, I gotta trim it off. I got two fat ass bags to do here. Steaks are way bigger, but it seems like they got a lot more red meat on them. I kept the spoonbill separate so I could know like if every spoonbill I catch will taste different. Right now we're just trying to cut it into little strips like this. We'll try to cook it. All right, y'all, well, we got it skinned up. I got the spoonbill separated. This one, it's got a lot more of a red tint to it than this. This meat just looks super pure, like it would taste really good. This looks like it might be a little mushy or something. If I'm gonna grill these spoonbill, I'm gonna have to get one that's like 100 pounds, like a big old fat bill. Chunks of meat big enough to lay on the grill, but these, I mean, like little tendies. I'll show y'all the end result. Oh yeah, these are looking good. This is what we're coating it with. Put a little bit of that in it. Give her a little spice. This thing is still piping hot. Put a little salt on it. 
It's fucking delicious. Good. Try this. It's so hot. It's it is, isn't it? Uh, That's really good. It tastes like chicken tenders. I'm not even playing, y'all. I like that way better than catfish. So I ended up eating every piece of that spoonbill. Well, I gave a few to the dogs. I want to try the eggs out of one. Like, say I shoot a 100-pound female spoon, right? It's fully pregnant. It'll have 20 pounds of eggs on it. And that'd be like damn near five grand in caviar. But anyways, hope y'all enjoyed that video. And y'all let me know in the comments, do y'all want to see more bow fishing videos? Or do they suck? Do you want me to just like slap them in with a vlog somewhere? Or do you want me to make an entire video based on bow fishing? Like this one. If you want me to, let me know in the comments. But anyways, y'all, I'm about to hop off here. Love y'all. No homo. And I'll see you in the next one. Later.